what's up babes welcome back to my channel my name is angel so in today's video i am going to be doing a first impression and a review on the new maybelline super stay concealer so if you guys would like to see my thoughts on this concealer then just keep on watching so first off i would like to apologize for my super raspy voice this week has been crazy um some of you guys may know that i am a teacher um, so this week just started the um, new school term for 2019 2020 so I am super excited you guys I have been just busy um, getting my classroom together paperwork all of that jazz um, so now I'm back here on YouTube and thank you guys so much for the ones who have been like come on back where you at well yeah well yeah well yeah like I really appreciate that you guys I miss filming and I miss talking and communicating with you guys through YouTube so much. Um, also, follow me on my social medias. Um, they all are pinned down below. But um, I'm not going to talk and ramble too much, but just know your girl is back. Um, I feel so good to just be sitting here filming this video. Um, I miss y'all so much, like for real, for real. So let's go ahead and jump into this review. So this is what the Super Stay Concealer looks like. I actually purchased this concealer literally like three weeks ago um, but I'm just getting around to actually sit down and film hope I'm not too late hope I'm not too late so this is what the packaging looks like and this is basically a full coverage 24 hour uh, concealer um, I do have the foundation review here on my channel I make sure I leave a card somewhere up in here for that um, but this is basically a concealer to that foundation. So first I'm going to start off by reading you some of the claims of this concealer. So this concealer claims to be a 24 hour wearing concealer. It also claims to be a waterproof um, concealer, transferring resistant, and a lasting transformation finish. And it also claims to instantly wipe out dark circles. So we are going to put this baby to the test. And by the way, you guys, the shade that I got is shade caramel um, number 40. I always get shade caramel in all of Maybelline concealers, the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind, the Fit Me Concealer. I really just love the undertone in the caramel concealer. I feel like it is the perfect yellow undertone and it gives me that brightening effect that I really, really like in the concealer. So straight out of the box, this is what the concealer looks like. So this is pretty much the packaging. I just realized that I'm literally holding this concealer upside down, but honey, it is okay. I really do like this doe foot applicator. It reminds me of the ColourPop um, No Filter Concealer that is one of my favorites, and I actually love the applicator on that concealer as well. So based on this applicator, I am already feeling this concealer, you guys. So we are going to go ahead and jump into the demo. As you guys can see, this concealer is super smooth and super creamy. So this concealer is super easy to blend out. Honestly, I would not consider this concealer a full coverage concealer. Um, if you wanted to layer it a bit, I think that it may be buildable. It may could get to a full coverage, but upon just one initial application, I don't consider this a full coverage concealer. As you guys saw in the demo, this is actually a pretty nice concealer. This concealer actually reminds me of the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer, um, but it gives just a little bit more coverage than the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer, but not as much coverage as the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer. And I would consider this concealer to be a more um, matte finish concealer. So if you are a more drier skin type or tend to have dry under eyes, I wouldn't recommend this concealer for you. So as far as this concealer claims to instantly cover dark under eye circles, I'm not sure about that because clearly I don't have dark under eye circles, but based on my feelings and how I feel about this concealer, I don't think that it is going to cover dark under eye circles, especially if they are like super severe. You could try to layer this concealer up, like I said, to get a little bit more coverage. Um, but an initial one application, it is not a full coverage um, concealer. And as far as this concealer claiming to last 24 hours, you guys know your girl will never be able to tell you about them 24 hours, honey. Because even when I have a long night, honey, a long night, I still come home, wash my face, clean it off, everything. Like I never am wearing makeup for 24 hours. So as far as this concealer claiming to be waterproof, um, I really can't tell you about that part because I will never swim wearing like a full face of makeup. Honestly, you guys, I have done it once and let me tell you, it was the worst experience ever. So, um, as far as it being, um, it's saying waterproof, I'm sure it is 
probably maybe so waterproof i just actually wanted to try this concealer out and pretty much give my thoughts on it um i have not worn this concealer for an extended amount of time or um even before filming this video so this is literally a first impression so of course like i always tell you guys if you guys never see this concealer here on my channel again that means i hated it and it did not work out for me but if you guys see it again that means i love this concealer and as i wear this concealer more and test it out i will continue to update you guys and let you guys know how i like this concealer this is just a quick little video quick first impressions i'm back you guys i'm here filming these videos for you guys let me know what you guys would like to see um that's pretty much it remember to be blessed and follow your dreams and I will see you guys in my next video.